Good Wednesday evening, everyone. It's been a dreary day, just cloudy and chilly and wet with on and off drizzle. And that's going to continue for tonight into tomorrow. So if you're outside tonight or even tomorrow, bundle up and grab the umbrellas. This pattern will stick around. You can't really see the drizzle right there. Raindrops are simply too fine, but it is out there. That's going to stick around for tonight. As I said, if the winds come down, we could see some patchy fog. Look at the temperatures right now. We've been in the 40s and 50s for much of the afternoon. Right now, 43 in Westlaco, 46 in McAllen, 45 in Harlingen, 48 degrees in Brownsville. And those temperatures won't fall much more overnight into Thursday morning. So here's the day planner forecast. Dress warmly, dress the kids warmly. 44 degrees at 8 o'clock in the morning. 48 at noon, 50 at 5 p.m. There is still at least a 30% chance for some on and off patchy drizzle or some spotty showers during the day. Here's a surface map. Why are we seeing this type of weather? Well, we have the cold front to the south of us. So behind it, cold air is parked here at the surface over Texas. And above that cold air, we have some warm, moist air running over that cold air. So because of this overrunning weather situation, that's why we're seeing the clouds, the chilly weather, and the drizzle. And that will stick around, as I said, for tomorrow. But over the next couple of days, those high temperatures will finally start to moderate. Look at the temperatures across the state right now. 36 in Dallas, Fort Worth, 41 in Houston, 39 in San Antonio, 26 in Abilene, 30 in Midland, and a very chilly 19 in Amarillo. Here's future track. It stays cool for tonight and for tomorrow. The high temperatures tomorrow were only going to be in the lower 50s, but by Friday we're back to the lower 60s. There is still a chance for some more spotty showers on Friday. At least for Saturday and Sunday, the final weekend of 2017, the highs are back to the 70s. If you like the warmer weather, enjoy this weekend because come Sunday night, New Year's Eve, a very strong cold front is expected to arrive. So we expect those temperatures by early New Year's Day morning to drop into the mid 40s at this point with highs perhaps only in the upper 40s for New Year's Day Monday. We could be looking at low temperatures Tuesday morning, perhaps in the mid 30s. Again, this could still all change, but all indications are that it is going to be a a very chilly start to 2018. On the water, small craft advisory continues for the Gulf waters overnight. The bay waters are choppy, becoming a moderate chop tomorrow. During the day, we'll have winds out of the north at 20 to 25 knots. Next tide is a low tide at 450 in the morning, and the seas are 5 to 8 feet. So for tonight, more of the same folks, cloudy and chilly with a 30% chance of some spotty showers or patchy drizzle. Low temperatures will dip into the lower 40s. Then for tomorrow, again, cloudy and chilly. Dress warmly, keep the umbrellas with you. 30% chance of showers or drizzle with a high temperature of only 52. And here's that seven day forecast, a slow warming trend for the next four days. 62 Friday, 74 Saturday, 75 on Sunday. There is still that 20 to 30% chance of some showers, but look at those temperatures drop behind that front for New Year's Day Monday, we're looking at a low temperature of 44, 48 for Monday afternoon. If you're going out for New Year's Eve Sunday night, dress warmly as well and take the umbrellas. In addition, behind the front, the winds will crank up. It's going to feel even chillier thanks to the winds on Monday, and we could be looking at low temperatures in the mid-30s by early Tuesday. That's your first 4 and 5 forecast. Now here's Brandon with a look at sports.